Yeah, hello everyone and welcome back to the demo, I guess. I mean, it's, <laughs> it's sort of kind of a walkthrough of a demo, I guess. You know, it's an educational type of dealio, but not a full game. But anyway, so <laughs> in the last part we got a whole bunch of jobs and oh. Now, you can head to the dungeons from that road. I see, I see. As I wasn't able to pick before. Once you receive a job, let's go to the dungeon and solve the Pokemon's troubles. Can I finally check the news here? Check the mail. Welcome to a red finally! <laughs> to all new members. Your badge has the power to send back to town any Pokemon you've rescued. Just hold the badge up and it does the rest. By advancing through your adventure, you will be rewarded points that raise your team's ranking. Aim for the bronze rank for now, Pokemon Rescue Organization. Alright. Mailbox is empty now. We have done it! And you can also check your jobs here, I guess. <laughs> and, oh wait, old news? Is that where the news flopped over to? Yeah, okay. Alright, so we have two places. Tiny Cave- uh, Tiny Woods! Thunder Wave Cave! It sparkles around the dungeon name. That's a sign you'll get a lot of stuff. You can get all this toy- oh, Really? Ooh! That's new! So I'm definitely gonna try the sparkly then. I was I was thinking Tiny Woods first, but on the way of cave it is then. <laughs> all right. So since we went through all the teachings and the like, I guess I could show you how to play a little bit faster this time. How's that sound? Shall we go? Let's go. I guess you could do that. That's fine by me. But <laughs> I was gonna save the gravel rocks for a more important. Oh wow, a more important scenario. But anyway. So, one whip! Ooh, doubled. Yes! And... Sure. <laughs> so yeah, uh, when I'm playing it more normally, I'm holding the B button a lot when I don't see any enemies in the vicinity, because I can just kind of zip through things a whole lot quicker that way. And I also skip enemies for the most part, because they just keep spawning, but if they, you know, if I come across them, it's just... I'll battle them, of course, but, you know... <laughs> <laughs> it, just, it just seems like it, it's almost pointless, oh nice, it seems almost pointless to uh, keep battling them other than if you just want to grind, but I don't really think there's any need for for grinding in this game. Nice. Alright, so we're looking for the special stone, remember we had in those, uh, in those requests there, but I don't see any special stone here. It might not be marked on the map, which is kind of typical, so we're, we still gotta go around Normally and oh, normally and as such, that was just a complete waste of a movement, but that's all right. <laughs> you just, just burning all my gravel rocks. That's fine. That's fine. I don't really need the gravel rocks per se, but that fine. Do that if you want to. <laughs> so yeah, where is that? If it's not going to show up on the map, I've got to look for it manually. It's a at least it looked there. It is. It looked like a red stone with some stripey things like marbling or something like that. XAQ's famous stone, this is what you're looking for! That's one quest out of three completed. Woo! It never seems like you can have two quests on the same floor, at least in other Mystery Dungeon games, so... Next floor, I guess? There's a request beyond this point. Would you like to escape the dungeon? No escaping the dungeon. I want to keep going. I want to get all those quests done like a pro. We've seen all the rooms we can go on. And... What the? I see. I see. That's kind of a easy spawn point for getting that Voltorb, I've got to say. Thank you. <laughs> Voltorb rescued! We raise that badge. We send them right straight back to safety. There you go. <laughs> and I'm going to say no again, because there's still one more to go. Uh, probably not on this floor, but I'm going to go for those items over there. Oh, found the exits. Yep, that well, exit, I should say, not not exits. Oh, nice positioning there, Cyndaquil. You did you did a thing there. Oh yeah, the, I just I just realized that it's something instinctive there. Whenever you press the Y button when you're facing some other direction, it automatically faces you towards the enemy. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, I'm gonna try sludge just to see for kicks. I don't think it'll be very effective, but none of my other moves are very effective anyway, I just thought. I don't know, maybe just, just for the fun of it. Because I figured Cyndaquil would finish it off anyway. Yeah, that's definitely a pretty nice bonus there, I've got to say, at this, the sparkly places. Uh, yeah, I'm just gonna assume that all the other ones connect in other sort of fashions. Oh, my none. 
Aha! Oh, yep, so works. <laughs> yeah, whenever you do that looky thingy there. Oh no! Oh no! I attack! Oh! Ooh. What do we have here? Ah, so we must take it out of the dungeon. And uh, I guess that means treasure chest comes from drops from other critters? Perhaps, maybe? Leader and female, so that's the last one that we need to do here. Uh, is that it marked on the map, that blue... I guess so. I mean, the light blue, I should say. Anyway, go ahead and ember. Um, oh, Nice! My move has leveled up! Until that is increased its versatility, its power! Well, again, maybe it just made me power. So, <laughs> I thought I would try the A button again, because it seems like it does the right attack that I'm aiming for in a given moment. Oh man! Oh man! Level up! Level up! Level up! And up! And up! Yeah! Great to level up! And... Yep. So yeah, that is the uh, client. And job completed. So we did all three in mere minutes. So you can get through this pretty quick. Uh, so yeah, I, I, it was just mainly what took me so long in the other parts is just me teaching you a bunch of stuff as I went through with my mystery dungeon of veteranness. Well, with I should say of what I remembered since I'm a little bit mystery dungeon rusty-ish. <laughs> but details anyway. Uh, I'm gonna go take a look, see what these items are really quick, and maybe I'll go down to the. Whoops. <laughs> okay, you do that. You you take on the Rattata. And... Okay, that's fine. That that. <laughs> <laughs> you guys gonna say you take on the Rattata, I'll keep on going. It doesn't really seem to be much of a threat of any sort of critters thus far, you know. Everything's just been pretty easy breezy. Unless they're gonna come to a boss in the next dungeon. Which I presume will open up after I Oh I'm getting hungry. Oh man, I've been wasting that much. <laughs> and maybe I should just escape from the dungeon. Save some time, because it's just one more floor after this, right? Yeah. Yeah, sure. Whoops, no. Actually, wait, wait, What about that treasure chest? Do I have to make it all the way through that? Through the dungeon to open the treasure chest? I don't know. Because if so, maybe I should just go... I, I still have that apple from earlier, by the way, so I'm not too concerned about... Uh, as a matter of fact, maybe I should show you how that works. See my belly at the upper right corner? I bet it should increase after eating uh, the apple! I can also switch to Cyndaquil, as you know, as I mentioned earlier, but... Yeah. So it would work just fine as well. Oh, oh yeah, I didn't notice you coming over there. Oh man! Just growled me into oblivion. Uh, if I press the E button... Now yeah, it even works through my partner. Very, very interesting. Uh, but yeah, I don't know if I'd want to use that all the time. Oh yeah, I probably should have went on the Wonder Tile to get my stats back up. That'll work. <laughs> it's another Wonder Tile. I'm just kind of zipping through things at this point. Because you see how things are rolling now, so... I could show you the more speedy, efficient way of playing the game, I guess you could say. Uh, no other blues on other areas, so might as well go. And there we go, last floor. <laughs> oh yeah, you do have to finish the dungeon dungeon, that's not a... Not that uh, good of a reward, that's a... Well, I mean, it's okay I, for the early game, but I mean, it's not really... I'm gonna get so many orange berries in general. Thank you for getting the famous stone! This is your reward! How too basic would be having fits just seeing that Pokemon right now. Sleep Seed, that can put the opponent to sleep if you throw it at them, or if you eat it yourself, you'll fall asleep. <laughs> Combine that with a Snorlax's snore or something like that, or sleep talk. Thank you for rescuing Voltorb! This is your reward! Perfect Apple! The biggest belly filler in the game, I think it is, I do believe. I think it should be, unless they change the item. That's why I say, I, I just keep saying I think, I believe. I'm just, yeah, <laughs> going back on my knowledge on other Mystery Dungeon games. Thank you for rescuing me, your reward! Reviver Seed, yes! Yes! That's the energy removal of this game. Well, not really, <laughs> but it is a really handy item to have. It recovers you to full health when you get knocked out. So yeah, it's just like you just keep on fighting no matter what as long as you have that in your inventory. You can basically fill up your entire inventory with reviver seeds and just win. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, 
And, well, in a lot of cases, I should say. I mean, they're, they're, still, they're expensive to make. I mean, they're expensive to get, and they're kind of on the rare side, so I shouldn't say you can just fill them up at will. <laughs> Good morning, Peek again. Let's do our best today. Oh! Huh? What's going on? Tunnel over here! Tunnel over there! Tunnel's everywhere! Woohoo! We're gonna get so much fun! Uh, uh, uh oh. I'm oh, sorry for ruining your lawn. Where am I? Yeah, what's going on? Oh, my, my apologies. My name is Diglett. I was having a blast digging tunnels in front of the Pelgrim Post Office. So much that I end kept on digging and ended up here. I'm sorry I ruined your nice place. Eh, don't worry about it. It's just a hole. Just cover it up like Animal Crossing. The grass regoes instantly. Are you saying you'll forgive me? It's twinkly eyes again. <laughs> too many holes might annoy ours, but don't think too, so don't think too many. Of course, thank you. From now on, I'll have fun digging, but uh, I also make sure to patch up the holes from time to time. You definitely should do that. People could fall in them all day long. Oh, that hole is being left, isn't it? <laughs> oh, oh man, this could be this could be our big break as new rescue team. Oh, I thought you were going to say something. Be here and stick with the jobs. We'll send the bolt on board for the time being. You ready to do the dungeon? Do the job. Okay. Check the mail train at Ma- Oh, I see. So the Makuhita Dojo is open. Read your Pokemon news. If you don't read your Pokemon news, your mailbox will get full and get the latest issue of the news or any job mail. Sometimes Pokemon news comes with a gift, so make sure to read it often. Pokemon Rescue Organization. Is this going to have a gift? I bet it's going to have a gift just because it said it. Oh, never mind. <laughs> you have dojo tickets. You can- Oh, maybe I can't. You can train at the Makuhita Dojo. I thought you didn't need tickets for that. Might be something new. At the Makuhita Dojo, your moves grow more than they do in dungeons, especially if you keep on hitting the foe with super effective moves. You can, keep, you can expect to grow a lot. You can also learn the controls at the dojo for free. Maybe I'll be able to learn how to do regular attacks. Check out check out the Makuhita Dojo when you want to learn how to move. Let it contain two... Oh, ooh, we can actually play that. Two bronze dojo tickets. May box is empty now. And news automatically plopped over there. Oh, the, even the Makuhita Dojo went over there. Uh, so I got two other jobs. I mean, just one, excuse me, one other job here. I should probably go and run through Tiny Woods really quick to do that before I head over to the dojo. So, ooh, and we got the sparkly treasures to boot. Let's go! So we just gotta run down to the second floor. And then we're kinda, we're kinda done. And it's, it's gonna be pretty quick. Oh no, I wanna switch places with you. Pick up Sleep Seed. I thought, every time I see a seed, I'm hoping it's a Reviver Seed. Blast Seed. That does damage to something in front of us. Let's see if we can do damage to... I'm gonna... I'll, I'll take damage here. I just wanna see... I mean, I just wanna show you the seed, basically. So we put that... Oops, we put that Blast Seed in our mouth. We eat that one tile in front of us. We blast... So yeah! <laughs> Uh, I should probably then go over to the other blue spot, and... Nope. Uh-oh. <laughs> so I skip that dialogue if I can help it. Alright, got the more of the peas to put in our pockets. And second floor for the rescue. And alright, a puzzle is... A oh man, that worm pull is really threatening. What will puzzle do? Actually, I think puzzle left it. <laughs> Anyway, I'm just waiting to see, because I don't know the pathway, so I don't want to, like, rush and hold the B button. So I don't... Oh, man. Uproar sneak attack. Uh, straight down, yes. And we're going to try that. Aha! So, oh, wait, sludge. That was actually the ideal move for the scenario. I wonder if when you press the A button, it automatically chooses the best move, so to speak, for the scenario. Anyway, I found the... Oh, wait, actually, maybe I shouldn't... Uh, Maybe I shouldn't leave so quick. I mean, I should have just, I should have grabbed the Rostberry up there. Thank you! Please come see me at the Pelper Post Office later. Uh, no. I, I kind of want to grab that. I feel bad. Oh, you... Don't, don't rejoin me. Just keep on grabbing. I just wanted to rejoin you later on, but not at that moment in time. Oops. I did not control stick myself properly. And... Fine, what? Just because, I don't know. I just like... It's hard to see. I don't know. Just, just want to. Anyway, um, mm, I think that's about it for this, huh? So I should go up one and. 
wrong corners, right? Yeah. <laughs> Actually, wait, was Sludge around corners, too? Yeah, Sludge was around corners. Whoops, my bad. I shouldn't have Vine Whip before in general, but I don't know, I even chose Vine Oh, I've chose Vine Whip before. No request to the left. Uh, let's say no. Just because it's one of those special sparkly treasure dealios. Might be able to get a little bit more out of it, I don't know. And then we can also just kind of see. Okay, so that, that was definitely not the best choice if I did have a choice there. <laughs> well, is Vine Whip the only one that was one square away in that sort of scenario that would do the most damage? I don't know, I just want to really experiment with the A button there. And I got the 20s. I'll go battle the other critter, I suppose. Hey, how's it going? Uh, sludge. I just kind of mashed through buttons, and that's why I kind of hit the vine whip earlier, but... Ah, okay, let's go. I don't see any more stuff listed on the floor, and that is another dungeon taken care of. Happy days. And we get a training seed. Woo! Storage. As the others go, yeah, I didn't. I didn't really put the reviver seed in storage like that because I said it. It, I mean, it said it went to storage, but I didn't mention that before. Didn't we do good today? Let's call it night and get some rest. Okay, see you tomorrow. Where we go to the dojo. <laughs> I wonder if this game saves actually. Hmm. Nope. Oh, dream time. Hmm. Hmm. Again. Am I dreaming again? Oh yeah, I just tried to fall asleep, dreams happen. It's that Pokemon again. But who? I don't see anything! Huh? They're talking to me? I can't hear them clearly, what are they saying? Huh? It's shaking. An earthquake? Whoa, it's getting worse! For Jane, this feels strangely real, but... Next morning. Oh, jeez, get out of the house! If it was a real earthquake! Oh, never mind. They were okay. Huh? Hello? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Hello? Uh, you are Pika Gam, aren't you? I might be. Who asks? Oh, you can't see us, of course. How very rude of us. We're pleased to meet you. We are Doug Trio. Last night during the earthquake. Oh, so there was one. That was no dream. Our child, Diglett, was attacked. Oh, jeez. But what Diglett? He was whisked away to the peak of a tall mountain. He couldn't possibly climb somewhere so high up. That's why we must... Well, let's just dig straight through it. That's why we must call up upon you for your help, Pikachu. Diglett was abducted by a Pokemon named Skarmory. Oh, man. It's a vilely vicious ruffian. Please do be careful. Please, we need your help. We must go. Hey, they covered their hole, and they regrew the grass instantly, just like Animal Crossing. That was so sudden, there was no time to even say no. But I am concerned to hear that Diglett has been kidnapped. It's too bad, I better go. Yeah. Yeah, holding the B button works here, just like it does in the original game, to travel a little bit faster outside of dungeons as well. Good morning, Pika again. Morning. Uh, you're just asked to go on a rescue mission. Yes. Our child Diglett was kidnapped. He was taking them on Steel Summit! Please, we need your help! Bye-bye! <laughs> just bye-bye. Okay. Uh, okay. <laughs> Wait, Diglett was the one digging holes here, right? That This kidnapping is worrisome. Let's go. Alright. Let's- Oh, You leave me on a cliffhanger. That's it for the demo version. You can play further in the full game. Can I still go to the dojo? You can look around the town freely. Okay. Go to the main menu, choose others from the X menu, and then save and go to the main menu. Okay. So... Oh, there's no mail. But so... Wait, hold on. One more thing. Will it... I just want to see if Mount Steel will even appear for the... Really? Can I get, at least get another... Rescue... Thingy... Thing from the bulletin? I guess I could. <laughs> Then maybe I could choose the dungeon <laughs> for, for later on, maybe? Might be, perhaps? I don't know. I'll just grab them all anyway, but yeah, I think they're just gonna keep on probably generating infinitely, so... I guess we could say that the adventuring main storyline is 100%ed, so... Dojo? Actually, can I look around just to be sure now? Okay. Hey, how's it going? This is the Makuhita Dojo. Only through rigorous training can we become stronger. 
fix it a trade what? Oh, this is... Oh, real, real, wait, what? So, wait, can I, can I choose that? Or, because I definitely, I definitely want the Reviver Seed or the Gold Ribbon, because the Gold Ribbon, you can sell that for a lot of moolah. Uh, Bronze Doja. Uh, yeah, what is this? Or do you have to, no, that's, that's I was going to say, do you have to pay that? Wait, what is, Jasper the Dungeon right? Oh, those really are stuff that you can do, huh? Uh, no. Well, what's the other one, then? Dojo Drills? Oh, this is your first time trying Dojo Drills? You have to give me a Dojo ticket if you want to try Dojo Drills out. The better the tickets you use, the more effective the drills will be. Choose which tickets you'd like to use. Okay. <laughs> uh... I guess Cyndaquil, probably, because I, I have more control over myself than my partner, so I'll make things a little bit easier, probably. But, oh! So it's going into a dungeon, then. Alright. Alright, let's do this. Dojo Drill, start now! <laughs> Alright, let's find out what we can do with this. And defeat the enemy with the time limit. There's no time limit in the original game. <laughs> I see. You can get a lot of experience and use super effective move. It's a fireplace! I oh wait, actually, if it was a fireplace, then I could, uh, probably wipe out that mile pretty quick. Driver seed, you know, auto mode to head for those enemies to get tons of things. Alright, let's go! No, oh, that, I didn't mean to. <laughs> okay, be button! Oh, that's right, I had to- Ah, oh, poopers! <laughs> I had to press the Y button to switch places. Alright, super effective move. Uh, oh, I see, I see. It's the fire dungeon because the, uh... The area- Oops, I hit the wrong button for my speedy setup here. Uh, it's the fire dungeon because everything is super effective to fire. Ah, uh, I see. I was gonna use attack moves anyway. Ah, ember! I guess I'm just gonna ember everything. Mm -hmm. Yep, you're also weak to fire as well, Mr. Weedle or Mrs. Weedle. And we go. Is there stairs in this place, by the way? I don't know. Because <laughs> for all I know, there's a way to extend this if you find stairs or something like that. Who knows? Who knows? All I know is we're running out of time! Well, we did decently, I guess, but <laughs> I didn't see any stairs there. Level up! Two levels from that? Really? Wow. That, uh, might be a little bit over level now. <laughs> it's all over. Nice work. You want to keep going? What if I say yes? Can I use that for the Bulbasaur then? You know, myself? Two kinds of drills Grass Maze and Poison Maze, really? Oh, I suppose because of super effective. Wow, this is more to this demo than I thought. <laughs> But I don't have any more tickets, so... Oh wait, actually I could get tickets from the, those other, uh... Those dealios, so I could probably do... Both of them here. The grass may sure. Right, let's do this, Dojo Drill stuff now! Yeah. <laughs> yeah, a lot more to this demo than I, than I heard. I, as, as I said, when I started, it was like... 45 minutes or something like that? 45 minutes to an hour? Okay, A button for my vine whips. Ooh, oh, that's really, really weak to grass. It's water rock type. And you go. Eh. Eh. I really, I really should be holding the B button more often. Wait, what? That? Come on now. <laughs> eh. Take that. Aha! I'm utilizing my A button properly now. Ha <laughs> Kind of. <laughs> Whoa, Kaboo tops. Okay, you do, you do that. I just want to get in. There we go. Just like get in position for getting the first attack there, if I can help it, while staying out of the range of the opponents there. Oh man, this is... everything's taking so long, and I'm, I'm on a time limit here! <laughs> Every, everyone wants to do a move, and everyone's in the room! I'm trying to mash buttons, but the time... <laughs> I didn't consider that, because the time just keeps on going, even when we're attacking and stuff like that. I got... I still got three levels out of that! Good lord! Jeez! Okay, so it's all over. Nice work. You want to keep going? What if I say yes? Nope. <laughs> uh, tricks, tricks of the trade. Okay, so what if I go for Bronze Dojo uh, ticket? A lot of hazards in dungeons, but you don't have to be afraid 
lot of items you can take in your toolbox help you on jam. Practice taking out and using the items you need. So is this like... Tutorials or... Or is this a uh, actual series of dungeons in on themselves? Oh, some to practice how to use items. You don't have to make it to the stairs to pass. First head to the right. Me. <laughs> item on the ground or in Barry. We're at full health. Let's stand on to pick it up. So yeah, this is like Tutorial Town USA here. <laughs> oh, it's everyone! Oh no, Blast Trapper HP is pretty low. I see. So that's why they set me up with that Orin Barry. Times like. These you want an orange berry like the one you picked up. Just press B to open your toolbox. Kind of showed you this earlier. I was pressing B, I swear. Okay, you can see the orange berry. Was it like desync? Orange berry in your toolbox, right? Go ahead and eat it. Okay. Yay! Happy days. An apple for the belly, I'm sure. There's probably a trap in front of the. <laughs> it's a trap in front of the apple, or after the apple. Next up, an apple. Go up and pick it up. Okay, got the apple. Let's keep moving. Hunger chat. Oh man! <laughs> Is that your belly empty? Who, who would have guessed there's a trap after that first trap? You know what I mean? You know what I mean? B button. B button. Thank you. Okay. I don't know. Why it's like this doesn't register the B button on the first couple presses here. It's kind of weird. Eat an apple, your belly refills. Let's keep moving. Stairs! Yay! Ish! Made it to the stairs. Congratulations, you pass. Want to use an item? Press B to open your toolbox. Don't forget it. Can I. Does this mean I could do this repeatedly to get those rewards? Or some. Really? That was. What if I say yes to that? Okay, so you got that prize. Can I actually select it again, though? Okay, so. Once you get it once, you can't get it again. I see! I see! Okay. So I should probably go through all of these, but first we're gonna go um, use the other ticket for the poison side of the dungeon. Here we go. Yep, so we gotta use our sludge this time, which I forgot the button command for. I think it was B. <laughs> L L Z plus B, right? L Z. No, no, no. Yeah, L Z plus B is is that? No. no. I didn't have it fully pressed. <laughs> we got ourselves a little bit of a fairy over here, and we got ourselves another fairy over here. Who? What, what move should we use? Oh, we should probably use some sludge because it's, it's kind of the idea. <laughs> By the way, isn't this the music from the uh, um enemy defeated? But yes, no, no. I'm rushing things here because I'm the time limit. But yeah, isn't this the music from when you're in a monster house? Oh no 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 no! <laughs> that was way too much damage. And actually, wait, I should just go A button. Yes, I'm getting the hang of things. Yes, <laughs> but I'm running low on time, so I'm gonna try and go by the one that's got. No, no. I was gonna say try and go by the one that's. No, no. I was already down the pathway. It was going the other way. <laughs> I was in two more levels, jeez. But yeah, I was already gonna- I mean, I was, uh, gonna try and get not teamed by everyone so that I could get another attack in before the timer ran out, unlike that other time. Poison powder, do I want that? Uh... Mm. Wait, don't you mean it has no effect on poison-type Pokémon? Because grass Pokémon, they should be able to be poisoned. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, um, I guess for the fun of it, like, actually no, maybe I should skip this one. Uh, yeah, I don't think that's gonna be as useful as any of the other ones, because we're, we're, our main goal is to wipe out enemies quickly rather than long, you know what I mean? Anyway, yeah, oh, that was two moves, uh... I wasn't really paying much attention. Maybe I want the sleep powder. So instead, the leech seeds, similar to poison. See, so yeah, I never got to use the leech seed. I mean, I guess I could still in the future if I wanted to make another part of this, but I don't know if that's really, really necessary. It's all I swear, I gotta keep going. Yeah! Oh, I mean, not here, though. Uh, tricks of the trade, I guess. I guess I should go through all these really quick. Use moves. Because maybe they're. Maybe they'll finally teach me how to. Shoot. <laughs> Use a regular attack if it exists in this game. Use moves. Regular attack, please. 
All right, let's work on moves. By the way, you've got some different moves than normal, but that's just for practice. <laughs> now go ahead and use a move on me. Come a step closer to me and press- I wouldn't want to go a step closer, that would mess with the turn order. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna see the moves, so the practice. Oh, I can't? Okay, well I gotta move a step then. Use a move with A. Okay. Oh, it's just a singular room. Guess I got tackle. That's it, that's how you use moves. I need to choose a move. You just hold ZL and press- So yeah, you really just can't choose a move when you press A, it just happens. Which is the one to hit me with. <laughs> oh. I got Iron Tail? Oh, I don't have Iron Tail. Let's <laughs> just say. Uh, let's try a Growl. Yeah! <laughs> That's it. That's how you use move. Let's see. Three more. Come at me. Tackle! Growl! Mm. One more Growl! Ugh, I'm not doing any damage, but just because. <laughs> Alright. I've completed the training. I have done my duty as a rescue training. <laughs> yeah, I kind of got that from just playing the regular game, but I, yeah, maybe I should have came here earlier to get said tutorials. Four apples! Yay! Dash through the dungeon. Press the B button. Alright, let's do this. Chicks of the Trade lesson starts now! It's kind of. Awkward to do them in an out of order sequence, as I typically. Oh, this is is this the same layout as before? But yeah, I don't, I don't typically do things out of sequence, but I needed the tickets for the poison dungeon. Anyway, dash training and dash right through the street paths. Hold B and press L. Well, the L direction in the dash. Go ahead and give it a try. All right. Oh wait, what if I click the stick and move? Okay, it doesn't do anything. Just wanted to see. Woo! Wow, that was. Let's see, four more. Meow! Meow! <laughs> okay, so it's not the same, but it is. It is most certainly a straight corridor that we have no escape from, other than, other than just successfully going through there. You can make a way through straight paths easily if you dash. Hold B and press. Yeah, that's what I was showing you earlier when I'm doing my speedy speedies. Alright, so. Revolver seize! You really get that! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so that one's definitely worth doing. As a matter of fact, considering that you get all the stuff in general, it's just worth doing in general. Oh, escape from a monster house and everything. Oh, man. Oh, man. Push your Pokemon. Yes. All right, let's do this. So I guess we're going to push our partner back when we enter a monster house, I presume, and then finish off the critters. Oh. I want to push... Oh, never mind. We're not pushing our partner. Eh. That's how you push. See, more, four more! Push, push, push! Eh. And let's be even fancier! Eh. Oh, I was gonna... <laughs> I was gonna go eh, diagonally, but no, 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 no! I should be holding the Y button, when I, as I said before. <laughs> this is training mode, so... And... Back to the start! <laughs> I guess. Alright, okay. Completed. Yes, yes, yes. Use the I'll push other Pokémon. Yada, yada, yada! Congratulations, nice work! It's just, yeah, it's a lot of repeat dialogue other than that. So there's not really much to these then. Push a teammate. Oh! So yeah, that's, that's showing you can push the... Okay. So, let's go! Yeah, selling gold ribbon gives you a lot of money, so definitely worth doing so for the future. Let's go and push our teammates! Flashers passing by other Pokémon! Go towards me and press B while holding L! Woo! I said it's how you pass by another Pokemon. Four more. Eh. It's kind of kind of sucky that they pause you after every after every action you do. You know what I mean? There should just be a, a counter after they first say, "Okay, let's see four more," and then just end it at that. You know, don't have any more dialogue. You just keep going and you're just repeating that action on your own without saying three more, two more, one more. <laughs> Hey, gold ribbon! Oh yeah, I got. I knew that was gonna fill up eventually. Sure, sure, sure. Change direction without moving. No, that's the Y button that I was showing you earlier. There's not very much to read there. And <laughs> not much to scroll down through. Change direction without moving. I want the rewards more than anything and all the check marks. So what I'm changing. Wait a second. Hold on a sec. Do you have a twin brother? Are you triplets? What's going on here? 
By the way, those two Makuhita might- Okay, little brothers! They volunteer, <laughs> they volunteer to help. And you press Y to change directions. Try it out a few times. Oop. Oop. Okay, so it's teaching me to change directions by changing target like that. So you can press Y to turn your face Pokemon on any side of you. You can also just face whichever direction you want. Try holding Y and pressing L to keep changing the direction you're facing. Now this is what I was teaching earlier. So does that mean it'll be done after I check- Oh, after, after, after I check all directions. Nope, that's how you change the direction you're facing. Okay, time for the real fun. Now if you have a bad- Oh man! First attack the one that's awake. That's probably wise. Take out the sleeping Makuhira. If you don't deal with the other one that's awake first, you'll get attacked on the next turn. Won't pass if that happens, so be careful. One more time, okay? Attack the Makuhira that's awake first, then the sleeping one. Yeah, it's strategy they're teaching you. So that's actually a pretty good little tutorial there. It's more than just the controls. Alright. I don't have much of a choice, do I? Tackle! <laughs> Tackle! I don't know how they can sleep through all this fighting, but details. Congratulations, you did it! By the way, just changing your direction doesn't count as moving. Mm -hmm. Now change which direction you're facing as much as you want. Woo! So no turn skips there. I mean, uh, uh yeah, no, yeah, turn skips. I should, that is correct. You did it! Congratulations! That was more than seven on Max Elixirs. <laughs> and yeah, last one, right? Right, right. Moving diagonal. Yes, let's do it. Can't believe this little mini series is gonna end on a tutorial. <laughs> you think about it. Next, they're going to work on moving diagonally. Oh, I see. You see the stairs, right? If you make it there, you pass. But if you touch any of the other tiles, you die. Well, maybe not. It's probably. I think those are stat down tiles or hunger tiles. Yeah, hunger traps around the stairs. And those are especially designed just for the dojo. If you step on even one, you won't be able to move, and this lesson will end. Oh man. Stop a one, you'll have to try again from the start. That's where moving diagonally comes in handy. Olar and press L to move diagonally. Avoid the traps and move, get to those stairs. Okay, I'm gonna hit one just to fail once. Hunger trap. Hunger trap, bro. <laughs> it just kills you. <laughs> Are you okay? <laughs> Let's try it again. It can go so well. I'll give it your all next time. Yes. Alright. Yes. I didn't, I didn't think they pooped me all the way back out, though. Seems like a. <laughs> Seems a little inefficient. They could just say, oh man, you died. You wanna try again? Or you fainted, you wanna try again? Yes, 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 yes. Can I skip this dialogue since I've seen it before? No? Oh, okay. <laughs> Alright. Hunger traps. So yeah, we're gonna be we're gonna play as a bishop here. And okay, our button. Boink, 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 boink. Just to ensure our safety. We basically cannot touch the other tiles in general then. Unless you're, you know, you're on one of the blank tiles next to a tile that's on our bishop tile set. But anyway, I just, you know, if you're taking a normal path, you're not going to touch the tiles in general. Congratulations, you pass. You find lots of times that holding R to move diagonally will come in handy. Try not to forget it. I was kind of expecting those tiles to just like blow up or something like that, just as a joke. But that, that was close enough. Just an outright kill. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Not killed you. Yeah, congratulations, nice sir. Here's a reward. Some slumber wands puts them to sleep. You can, it's like a shooting item. Shoots, you know, it's like a wizard robe shooting something. All right, we're done. Actually, are we? Hold on, one. Just wanted to see if anything else unlocked there. All right, we are done. That. <laughs> see you later. Come back soon if you want to keep getting stronger. So yeah, all the stuff that we were collecting here it went over. Well, most of the stuff. No, not again. I'm not sure what's going on, but Doug Chew's child Jiggly was a knap kidnap, right? Let's check out Mom's Steel. I guess that was a new dialogue to see. But not again, that yeah. Alright, so let's just see here what we got throughout all of our adventures here. All nicely organized and rare and for us to go. See waving at a Pokemon makes Pokemon sleep for all. Similar to the sleep seed when you throw it at them. Um But you know, if you throw a sleep seed at something, they might be able to catch it and then use it back at you. <laughs> so the slumber one might actually be a little bit safer in that regard, in some cases, but anyway. So yeah, uh, so gold ribbon can be sold for a higher price at a shop. Can't take it out though, I'm at all full. I could, I could uh, store what we got, I was going to show you what we got throughout our adventures. But other than that, yeah, I think we are pretty much done here, because other than just repeatedly, repeatedly going to that board for ran <coughs> random, uh, uh, Rescue missions. I can't. I can't progress the story any further. 
guess I could see dialogue. There's a forest fire not long ago. It was terrible. Uh, no, same dialogue as before. So I'm gonna. It's probably safe to assume that everyone else has the same dialogue as well. Uh, kinda. I mean, yeah, same dialogue. So yeah, I guess that's it. That's all I could do here. This is as 100%ed as I can make it. <laughs> so with that. I'm gonna end off this mini-series here. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you back to a main series later on.